Edinburgh Reporter went down Leith Walk today to have a look at Leith Late's new initiative, The Mural Project Continued. We met up with street artist Guido van Helten to find out where he gets his inspiration from. Um, well, basically, I like to I like to travel and mix travelling with painting, and I've come to Edinburgh, and I like to kind of research archive photographs from the area and and the surrounding place. So, basically, these are just some interesting photographs I found uh, based on the Edinburgh Arts Festival in 1961. They're just two. Uh, scenes from a play and I've kind of like laid them compositionally on the wall within this within this space. So I started on Monday, I completed one face on Monday and then uh, yesterday I worked on this one and then today I've just been kind of like wrapping it all up. Well Leith Late is a multi-arts event um, that takes place one night only um, across multiple venues in Leith um, and it's happened for the last three years. But also um, recently we've had the Shutter Project, um, marrying up artists and businesses and most recently the Mural Project which um, brought a collective of artists together called Blameless to do a massive mural um, at the bottom of Palmyra Street and then um, most recently We've had Guido here um, who contacted us just about a month ago um, to do some work in Leith. I, I think it enriches people's lives to be honest. I think that it's, it's, it, it, it's brightening up and beautifying um, sad spaces, um, disused spaces and hopefully kind of making things just a little bit more cheerful for everyone. Then we asked some passers-by what they thought about the mural. I think the mural was going to add, add a bit of colour and a bit of spice to, to the area. It was uh, just a building that was lying dormant for years and years and just lying there, nothing happening to it. So anything that can make it look a bit more attractive is a good thing in my opinion. I think he's making a, a fabulous job of it. Um, some of the detail he's putting into it is absolutely brilliant. And then the best part was that Guido added his signature to the mural to finish it off.